we will implement our application on uh, linear layout so go to text and from here change the change it from relative to linear you can see our layout has changed from relative to linear also we will implement our application on vertical uh, orientation so on go to properties orientation and select it vertical now go to this palette container and drag and drop one radio group radio group is a container which is used to group radio buttons all the radio buttons placed inside this region are grouped together now we will change the id of this uh, uh, radio group as rg underscore animal so what we are going to do is to have three radio buttons which would be used to choose your favorite animal so we will drag and drop radio buttons inside this radio group now we will rename these buttons as you can see i have renamed the buttons as cow cat and dog and also changed their ids as radio button underscore cow radio button underscore cat and radio button underscore dog out of these multiple mm, buttons we would be able to choose only one option this is the unique property of radio button also we would reduce the size of this radio group so that it acquires minimum space now we would add a button which would be used to display the selected option so we will drag and drop one button and rename it as submit so this is our design part let's talk about the coding part now inside this main activity we would declare three variables for radio group radio button and the uh, submit button we would declare only one button for the radio, uh, radio buttons because the user will be allowed to choose only one single option now we will create a method so that when this method is called inside this on create method it can listen to the button click event we are going to cast our radio group and the submit button inside this method now we will set on click listener for the submit button inside this on click listener method we will define a new listener method inside this on click method we will declare an integer variable 
for getting the ID from the group. You can see we have cast the radio button and passed the mm, ID as select underscore ID as an argument. Now whatever button is selected we can get the text and display it using toast. For implementing toast we need to import the toast library. So go to import and write You can see we have successfully imported the uh, toast library. Now we will uh, now we will create an instance for our toast. We will set the duration of the toast to length underscore sort as we have to display the uh, toast for a sorted duration. Now we will call this on click listener button inside our on create method. So I will copy and paste it inside the on create method. So we have finally completed the design as well as the coding part. Now let's generate the signed APK.